Meeting is now streaming live on Facebook. So apparently we are live, but I never know now with this new Facebook live thing. I hate it. So let's go down to it. Uh, I am Paul Turner and I work from my, well, work. I, I am based in the UK and this is my little home office here in a place called Cornwall in the UK, if you don't know me. But you don't want to know about me, guys. You want to know about Mr. Gallagher, now, the gentleman to whichever side that is is Les Gallagher. Some of you watching this will know him because you're in our group. And Les came to me, was it three, four weeks ago, maybe? Yeah. And just happened to say, this is all I do now. <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean this is all you do? Yeah, don't go back. I don't, I'm not going back to work. I just trade. So another one of the group that's gone to be a full-time trader. So uh, I thought, let's get Les on. And while I share this link out, <laughs> Les, in the course of the next, I don't know, 20 minutes, half hour, however long it takes, I'm gonna I'm gonna get Les to share the strategy he uses, what it took to get full time, being a full time trader, um, and I'm also gonna tell you how you can not only learn exactly what Les does, you can actually follow Les. This is like the perfect storm. Often you see these interviews and it's like, oh, I brought this training course and you can get this course now on a special deal and all that. This is even better because Les actually goes live in our group four times a week. And you can actually learn direct from Les himself. So Les, why don't you introduce yourself while I share this link out? Yeah, my name's uh, Les Gallagher, as Paul's already said. Um, I um, met Paul um, around, well, just over a year ago, actually. We were doing something else, another uh, business. And I met Paul there. Paul uh, was invited to speak that day. And... Uh, I don't know what it was, but something resonated with us that day. I don't know whether it was Paul's NLP. Um, it's my boyish good looks. These telepathic messages he was sending, but um, I had a chat with Paul, and uh, I, I, he, you know, he told us he was trading forex. Uh, so uh, I took a look at it, and I decided to um, join in with the Ninja Group, and um, I haven't really looked back uh, since. Um, oh. Did you have trading experience before? Um, yeah, um, a bit. Um, I actually started trading stocks and shares back in 2000, so about 20 years ago. Um, and that was with very uh, limited success. Um, I did lose some money, actually, um, when 9-11 happened. Wow. Uh, but, um, so I stopped doing that because you've got to have a period of recovery after that. Um, and I was actually working at the time in a local uh, car factory. I, I worked there for 22 years, actually. Um, but in 2009, uh, I decided to leave uh, there. I had the opportunity to leave, which I did. Um, and I started Forex trading in 2009. Again, um, I, I just want to uh, make, uh, make this point. I, I, I did it um, on my own. I tried to learn it uh, on my own. I did have a, a guy um, who was uh, sort of like teaching us or trying to coach us or something, but unfortunately he uh, passed away. Um, and it just sort of drifted away. I just had limited uh, success with it and it just drifted away and I, and I just went back to work and I never, I never um, did Forex trading again until um, 2019. 2019, that's when you joined us. That's when I joined the Ninjas and the Academy, yeah. Right, so how long has it actually taken you then? What, what month in 2019? So how long has it actually taken you to come in and get to the point where you've jacked the job in? Yeah, I joined in April 2019. And I've got to say, for the first... Um, and this will probably resonate with uh, quite a lot of people. Um, for the first two to three months, I would say, I uh, didn't really know about too much that was going on. Um, I was doing uh, done-for-you trades, uh, the, the copy and paste ones, um, with varying degrees of success. Um, I, I haven't blown any accounts, uh, by the way. I haven't, I haven't done anything like that. But um, it was up and down. It was like one step forward, two back, um, two steps forward, three back, uh, four steps forward, uh, three back. And it was just, it was up and down, up and down, up and down. Um, 
and it was actually, uh, and this went on for around about six months, actually. Um, and wow. in, in, in that space of time, um, I was learning uh, what was going on in the academy. Um, I was using the products in there. And, and I think um, because of what was on offer, um, I got a little bit um, sidetracked trying all the different things that's on offer, right? Also, um, just just to give you um, a heads up on this, to save you um, three to six months. Um, yeah, I was going to say, you bet you wish you did work this out earlier. So. <laughs> yeah, just, just, just stick to one thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and the one thing, what I stick to now, is the most successful thing. So there's, there's a lesson there somewhere. Okay, so about a year, but knowing what you know now, you could have done it less. So let me, we'll dive into strategy and what you do and what you recommend and stuff. But somebody that was starting, we're all different. So we can't make claims that it will take you this long. But if you knew now what you knew back then, how long do you think it would take you now? I'm talking about less, I'm not talking about what everybody will do because everybody's different. But if you just applied yourself like that and you just focused on the, the one thing, how, how long do you think it would have taken you? Honestly? Yeah, that one. Three months. Three months. Ninety days. Ninety day commitment. Yeah, three months. Okay. That's, that's being honest with you. Three months. Because Les, I know. I I talk to Les, and Les is like, I'm telling you, this stuff's powerful. I mean, it'll show me something, and then it's been something else, and then it's been something else, and he's been winning because Les actually does put trades out into the group. But then when I spoke to him the other day, and he told me the strategy he's using, I was like pleasantly surprised. Uh, not amazed, pleasantly surprised. So, um, what else do I want to ask you before we reveal the big strategy? Because that's what everyone's going to want to know. So, so how many hours a day do you work now? Talk us through your day. <laughs> um, I normally get up about uh, seven o'clock, seven thirty, um, and then I'll just get myself sorted out, have a cup of tea and stuff like that, and join. Uh, the live session normally at nine o'clock. Um, we're in unusual circumstances at the moment. Um, you know, I've got a couple of grandkids who, who, who stay with us. So uh, normally they're going to school and things like that. And I do a school run. But um, what's been happening in the last uh, couple of months, really, uh, since the lockdown and stuff like that, is I normally just um, get myself up in the morning, uh, have a cup of tea, get myself sorted out, and then come and join uh, Paul's session at 9 a.m. And I watch that live session for um, nine o'clock. I don't, personally, I don't consider that as a trading time. Um, it's more um, being in the group, in the ninja group, it's more a support mechanism for me, uh, as well as the other people who are on there, because we get lots of people. We've got over 500 in the ninja group now. So there's always like quite a lot of people on there. Um, it supports me um there's people ask questions in there um if there's a trade comes along i will take that trade but normally i don't sort of look at trades um until on a monday um till round about this time now till about one o'clock what well, one, yeah. 1 p.m um and then on a monday i'll, I'll maybe take a, a one or two trades uh on a monday um sometimes i do three uh sometimes i do four but um, I don't normally do any more than that. Um, and then on a Tuesday, it's just the so same. So you're not a high, you're not a high frequency trader then. So you. No, I'll, I'll, I mean, um, last week uh, I did fourteen trades last week. Okay. Fourteen. Two or three a day. Yeah, and uh, that was for a total of one hundred and forty-five pips. So just over ten pips per trade. A couple pips. of trades in there. I, I, one I did five, one was six, but most of them I go for ten. So what's your reasoning then? We're going for a small number of pips. <clears throat> right. Um, if I go back to uh, October, uh, last uh, October last year, um, we there was a um, something happened within the academy, um, and we had um, the thing called the banker strategy came along and yeah. stuff like that. So. I was really interested in that and I spent a, a lot of time actually. Um, that's when I, I decided then in October um, that I wasn't going to do anything else 
but I was just going to concentrate on the banker strategy. So I did that from October uh, right up until um, January, actually, January, February time. Uh, and what happened was um, we went to the convention. And uh, I, I mean, this is going to sound, I don't know, I don't know how it's going to sound, but I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> um, we went to the convention. I met some of the other people who were in the group and we had a great time down there. It was fantastic. Uh, two days down in London. Les did. Les was last one out of the bar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well I'm hardcore now. It's hardcore. Yeah, now. hardcore, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I had a great time down there. met everybody. But um, there's uh, two things. Well, three, actually. It's three things happened. Right? The first one was actually meeting everybody uh, in the Ninjas uh, who went there uh, in the flesh. Um, and of course, you know, we all knew each other because we do this all the time. We do this every day. So that was great. That was the first thing, right? To see real people who we all doing the same thing. So that was the first thing that there was really powerful. Um, the second thing was being in that conference uh, with 7,000 people. 8,000 people there, apparently. 8,000 people in that conference. The energy in the room. I've never experienced anything like it. I'm 58 years old, by the way, and I have been at a few of these. It was absolutely uh, amazing. Um, it, it blew my mind. The third thing was actually uh, Bob Proctor uh, coming on the stage and doing his thing, talking about paradigm shift and yeah. frequencies and stuff like that, you know. And uh, anyway, I, I left there and I was coming home on the train, uh, coming back up to the northeast uh, of England. And all I thought about on the train on the way home was, uh, this is it like you know that's it i've made my mind up this is what i'm going to do and um from uh march march the first right this is how quick it was from march the first i've only really done one one strategy right and that is uh byob cash out strategy 10 pips a day from march that's all I've done. That's why I was pleasantly surprised when Les told me that, because I know Les is awesome at the banker strategy, which is all about to the pip entries and a lot of precision. And the BYOB is this, probably the simplest strategy, in my opinion, that we teach. And if you'd agree with that, Les? Definitely, yes. And normally I say that's your introduction strategy. And then from there, you kind of progress. Les has actually gone all the way back round. Yeah. So, so why why do you just focus on the BYOB then? And it's allowed you to go full time. People like I've got people that are in the ninja group watching this, right? Okay, and we've got people that aren't ninjas yet. Okay, I just want you to just listen again to what Les just said. He uses what we are saying is the basic strategy that we teach every day on the live trading sessions. We that strategy is getting less free from his job. So I just want to make that very clear to everybody. You are getting exact. Les, are you doing it any differently than what we teach? No. You have got the tools, right? You have got the tools to be able to do what Les has done. Okay, now, if you were a carpenter, you have the same chisels, the same hammer and everything, same screwdrivers, same drills, might take you the same amount of time as Les or longer than Les to learn to use the tools very effectively. Okay, but it's the same tool and it is pretty simple. So, so why did you focus on that then after you're doing all this other amazing stuff? Um, the first thing was, it was just the fact that doing the other stuff, um, there's a lot of uh, analysis, a lot of analysis involved, um, a lot of drawing up charts. Um, you know, you'll hear the phrase uh, naked charts and stuff like that. Uh, I, do, I do I do trade uh, the charts naked, but um, it's uh, it's it's um, the amount of time you have to spend looking for these trades, identifying them, um, drawing up areas, points of interest, and stuff like that. It's great stuff, mind. I love it. It's fascinating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. But what I'm not I saying there's anything wrong doing that, guys. It's great. No, no. But it, it is great if you're into that, and I am into that. But what I found was. Um, it was taking up quite a bit of my time and um, the risk, the rewards are, are, are great. They're amazing. Um, you know, don't get us wrong, uh, you know, risking like a small amount to get like four, five, 10, 20, 30 times that amount. It's, it's great. But, um, it, but once you're in the trade, it's like managing it. 
when you're in the, when you're actually in that trade. And I thought to myself, I'm spending way too much time here um, doing this. So I thought to myself, I, I do need to change how I'm doing stuff because there's the fact that I was sitting in front of the computer all day, um, put weight on. Um, I was I was spending less time uh, with my family and and, I, and you know th this is all going on in my mind and I'm thinking to myself, this isn't what I really want to do, and I was getting like too focused on it on that particular thing. So what I done was, I decided that I would just concentrate on. BYOB, right? Because the fact is, 10 pips a day will change your life. All right. Now, I, the only thing I do different to um, what maybe other people do is I have a trading plan. Right? <laughs> now, some people, um, and I know this for a fact, right? Some people start trading and they don't know why, right? They're, they're not, they haven't got a trading plan, they don't have any targets. They just think that they need to put trades on and they will win and that will be it. And it doesn't work like that. You need a trading plan. You need to stick to that plan uh, quite rigidly, uh, very rigidly. Um, but if you do that, right, it will um, it will take your trading to the next level. Um, now, my, my daily target is 15 to 20 pips a day, right? I don't do 10 pips a day. That's the, that's, that's the only difference. I, I normally go for um, 15 to 20. And the reason I go for that is, is that I want to um, withdraw some money out of my account, right? I don't want to um, compound. Well, I do actually compound it. Um, but, I do, you know, the, like the 3% a day thing, which is absolutely nothing wrong. But I thought, well, I'm going to need to be um, having some income from this. So I, I use the withdrawal uh, trading plan uh, where you go for you go for thirty percent, yeah. So Les's plan is actually in our member group. So when you become a member, if you are a member, if you go into the unit section, you'll actually see it in there. And like Les, our basic plan just to show people the power of compounding and what can happen if you just do one trade a day. Well, you can do two trades a day. So that's basically what Les is doing, and that gives you room to um, take some out if you want to be full time and pay the bills. Which is Les, Les is doing. So I just want to make it clear: you will get access to Les's trading plan. So not only do you get the strategy, not only does Les himself teach it four times a week, you actually get his trading plan as well. So we're, we're giving you everything, guys. <laughs> we're giving you everything. Yeah, yeah. I have to go for um, five, uh, six percent a day. So like right. Paul said, instead of ten pips for three percent, I go for between fifteen and twenty to get six percent. Um, I'll come with mention percentages. Um, we're not we're not meant to right, talk sorry. about what we actually get, but you can talk about what your target is. Yeah, that, your personal target. That's my target. Yeah, yeah. that's my. So target. that's yeah, and I mean we're not allowed. the The thing is, that there's this thing called the FTC, the Federal Trade Commission, and they are very intent that obviously we don't entice anybody into joining something based on like flashing the cash or percentage increases and stuff like that. Um, so, so we don't, we're very compliant. Um, but just the fact that Leslie's now doesn't have to go back to a job tells you that he's doing well enough. Okay. Let's just leave it at that. Shall we? Okay. Yeah. Without getting into that rabbit hole. So, um, so you, you can trade, right? Why are you still with IM Academy? Because, <laughs> because. The fact that I'm still with the uh, with IM Academy is what they actually offer you. Um, and if it wasn't for what I learned um, in the I, IM Academy, I wouldn't be actually sitting here today uh, because of what I, what the what they've taught me. And the great thing about it is, is that um, it doesn't actually cost me anything now, <laughs> right? So, you know, it's like free. So why why would I want to leave? Um, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't actually cost us anything. So why would I want to leave? Um, I've invested a lot of time uh, and effort and uh, money with a, with a monthly subscription for a while. So I feel that um, I've invested in myself. So I want to get something back out of that, um, which I do get. Um, the, uh, the best part about it is uh, the go live 
um, educators in there where, you know, where they've got these uh, master uh, Forex traders and, and uh, another uh, um, financial markets as well. Uh, absolutely amazing what they do. Um, you know, so you can learn a great deal from that. Um, so that's why I'm still with the Academy. Uh, and of course, um, if I wasn't still with the Academy, I wouldn't be able to be in the Ninja group. So that's, yeah. that's the main reason. That's the main reason. And you still use the scanner and the vibrata? Yeah, I use vibrata um, every day and I use the harmonic scanner. They are the only two I use, by the way. Um, yeah. um, I don't use anything else. Um, there's lots of products in there, which I've tried uh, with, uh, and they're all successful in their own right. Um, if I was going to give advice to anybody, is just get good at one thing. It doesn't matter what it is, right? It doesn't matter what it is, but just stick to that one. Just stick to that one thing, the one thing you resonate with. Um, with me, uh, initially, it was the harmonic scanner. And that's how I started, like by using the scanner. Um, there's lots of strategies and, and things like that you can do with the harmonic scanner, so it's really versatile. Um, that comes free anyway with, uh, you know, when you join the academy. So um, but that's what I started with. But um, I do use uh, Vibrata. Um, and if you want if you want to know how I use Vibrata, um, it's the fact that, if uh, if there's a, a potential alert comes on the vibrata on the five minute time frame, it doesn't really matter whether I've missed it or not because um, once you get an understanding of how this works, obviously five minute candles drive the fifteen minute, the fifteen minute drives the yeah. one hour, and so on and so forth. Yeah. Um, with uh, the um, exclusive tools we've got, particularly the the uh, the Ninjicator, uh, Ninjicator Plus, um, Do you use that. Yeah, every day. Yeah, we are. Yeah, that's 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 the main thing I use um, to get me uh, into trades um, to help me identify uh, the best trades. So I know we're not talking about uh, earnings and stuff like that, but I can tell you um, that the last thirty-four uh, trades I've done, BYOB, the ball one. Wow! Wow! So. I don't think there's a lot else to say, <laughs> right? So we got a guy who is not only using one of the strategies that we teach, and there's really three main strategies now in our group. The first one is BYOB. The second one is called 25 to Life, which if you can't sit at a computer for long, it might suit you better, okay? But we have people that do great with that as well. And then we have a guy in our group called John Doherty, who's awesome, who uh, follows one of the trainers on IM Academy religiously, and he's been introducing that and how he captures a lot of tips that way. So you've, you've kind of got three really good strategies now in our group that we're just sticking with, okay? Because they're working incredibly well. So this is, this is what I'm looking at, right? This is why I want to do this interview with Les. There's people in our group that don't have to go to work. Les is one of them, but Les... Not only is using the BYOB, not only is he using the tools in IM Academy, not only is he using the Ninjicator, which is our team exclusive, no one else has it. He's also one of our live traders. Um, and you're on Monday to Thursday, sometimes on a Sunday, well, but Monday to Thursday, 7 p.m., which is yeah. great if you're in the US and it's 7 p.m. UK. So it's obviously great for UK. So we're giving you the chance to get taught by Les. You know, I teach BYOB. I do it. That's what I do. And I, I did five pips this morning yep. on my session in front of everybody. Okay. When we actually broadcast the app publicly. So if you can't make Leslie's session, don't worry. Get on mine. Get on one of the others. We all teach the same stuff to make it consistent because that you will, I don't care what you say. When you join, you'll get overwhelmed. That's that's the thing that everybody, when everybody comes in, everybody's overwhelmed and let a bit of experience. So we're giving you a, a guy that's living proof. And you can actually come in, get the same tools as he uses, the same strategies he uses, and get freaking taught by it. Live, live, mine. <laughs> so I don't know what else we can do. <laughs> I really don't know what else we can do. So what we can do is we can give you a seven-day trial of our group where you can come and see for yourself exactly what Les does. We can do that for you. Okay, and you just need to get back to the person who shared this video with you. There might be a button below. But we're all about zero hype. Okay, so that's why we do that. 
You can also get your hands on IM Academy for seven days. You do have to pay. We can't control that. Everything we do is free. Les doesn't get paid for doing those sessions, right? So we can't help the fact that IM Academy tools cost money. But if you get them, they, they offer a seven-day money-back guarantee. So you can even, like, within seven days go, do you know what? Not for me. Don't like it. And you can leave. So, so we've got everything going on to help you out. So, um, Les, is there anything else you want to add or anything we need to tell them? Or? I'll, ju I'll just say there's three things you need to do. I've already mentioned one of them, right? And that is um, find one uh, strategy, right? And we've got three fantastic strategies, right? We've got three strategies that will suit everybody. It doesn't matter whether you're working full-time, part-time, um, or whether you've got all day. We've got three strategies there. Out of those three, just stick to one, right? Stick to one and get good at that one. The second thing you need is a trading plan. You, you, you need a trading plan to follow that you can stick to what suits what you want, right? Oh, now we've got two uh, trading plans, right? We've got the three, 10, 10 pip a day, 3%, and we've got the one which I use, which is where, you know, you maybe go for 15, 20 pips a day um, and you can withdraw, um, with, where you can withdraw from your account at the end of the week or the end of the month, whichever way. Um, the third one is you've got to know your numbers, right? Now I know, because I, I know, right, this for a fact, because I never used to do it. You need to know your numbers. You need to know um, what trades you're taking, how successful you are at them, right? Now, I know people are going to go, oh, you've got to keep a journal, right? You've got to keep a record of what you're doing because how else will you know when there's the best time to trade, whether you're better at taking buys or sells, whether you have a particular currency, what, you're, um, what you favor without actually knowing it, right? Because you can trade all 26, 27, 28 pairs or whatever there is out there, right? But some of them, you're going to be better at others. And also the time of day when you're trading, you're going to find that on some days of the week and at particular times when the markets move, you'll probably find that that's when you're more successful. And what you can do then is you can actually narrow it down Right to um, a time of day, just like when I set the poll there. Um, I tend to take one trade in the morning and one in the afternoon. I tend to trade one on the London session and one on the New York session. And that, except on a Monday, where I just do it in the crossover on the afternoon. Uh, and then it's two to three a day, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and on a Friday, Jamie. <laughs> <laughs> just hang on one second. Hello. Go for it, that's fine. Just, and then on a Friday, um, just take one trade a day on, on, on the morning, right? And the easiest way to do that, one second, the easiest way to do that, right, is to um, do um, set up your account on myfxbook.com, right? I, I won't uh, go any further on that because obviously Jamie's coming now. But um, if anybody wants to know about that, just come on my live sessions and I'll show you how to do it. And that tells you everything. It gives you a breakdown of all your trades and everything without you having to write everything down. There you go. Top tip. So it's all about maximum reward for least effort, which is what we like. So as you can see, Les does indeed trade from home. <laughs> and these are the problems that like Richard Branson doesn't get. <laughs> all right, what's your name? That's Jamie. Go and shut the door, Jamie. Go on. No, Cheers, Jamie. Jamie. No. <laughs> That's, uh, sorry about that, but this is real. No, no, you're all right. That's fine. This is real life. <laughs> sorry. I'm not sorry because this is what people want. They want this. Uh, it's like, it, it, to me, it's great when kids come on and stuff like that and grandkids come on because this is the life people want. It doesn't yeah. happen at work, does it? Yeah, it is. But, you know, th this, this can happen. A lot, you know... I'm not going to talk about lockdown or anything, but this is what people want. So it's absolutely fine. So there you go. We are giving you absolutely everything we can do to help you be successful too in the form of Mr. Gallagher there and all the other live traders. We do pretty much the same strategies on every single session, a couple of slight variations, but we want you to be successful in this and we're giving you everything we can for that to happen. So uh, what would you say to anybody watching then, Les, that's on the fence? And we'll close it out. On the fence? Why are you on the fence?
Why are you on the fence? If you, you know, um, you've got nothing, uh, what, what I've got to say, uh, right, I'll, I'll have a think about this. If you're sitting on the fence, right, and it's probably because you're interested in what we are doing, but you've got something that's stopping you from taking that next step, right? Whether it's um, money, finances, or, uh, and, you know, whether it's mentally or, you know, whether, you, you know, all I can say is, right, we've got a seven-day trial. You can come in and spend seven days with us, okay? And you can see what we do. We are all real people. We are ordinary people. But we are doing something that's actually quite extraordinary, Right, and um, the the power, and this is wrong. This is wrong. What, what I wanted to say, the power of what we do together in this group is absolutely amazing. Uh, we're all in this together. Um, you know, we have a saying. You know, we 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 learn together, uh, we trade together, we learn together, we win together, and we lose together as well because we're not doing anything different on our live sessions. Yeah, when we're not on the live sessions, we might go off and and do some other trades. But yeah. in the main, when we are on the live sessions, um, we are, we are in this together, and that's what keeps us together. And that is um, that is the power of it. It's the fact that you've got a, a group, a community of people. You you are not on your own. We're all here, and we all help each other. We all have successes, and we all have failures, and we all know exactly what we are experiencing. Um, yeah. You know, we no, can't hide. Hard, it. We can't hide anything. You either win or you lose. And if you lose while others are winning, then, you know, I'm not, you know, obviously there's something that's not quite right there. Yeah. You know, and we can easily sort that out. You know, we can easily sort that out. So if anybody's sitting on the fence, um, just come and have a look for seven days. It doesn't cost you a penny. Just come and have a look. And at the end of the seven days, if you don't join us, that's fine. But um, you're going to, you're missing out on a fantastic opportunity. And, um, you know, w one last thing I want to add is, um, I'm not a multi-millionaire yet, right? I'm saying yet. And you'll be surprised um, how very little uh, you actually need to become financially free. It doesn't take a great deal, right? It doesn't take, you'll be really surprised. Um, obviously, I, I, can't, I, I can't mention uh, figures on you, anything like that. But you'll be surprised um, how quickly it can happen and how little in the scheme of things that you actually need to be able to maybe give yourself some options to become financially free to quit your job um, or anything like that it doesn't actually take that long and it doesn't really take um, a huge amount now on that on that note i used to work for a, a computer shop you know a pc world if you're in the uk and um I was like a department manager. It was a fancy title, really, just to get me to do more work for a little bit <laughs> extra pay. But um, we used to sometimes get like uh, training store managers and they would go around all the different departments. So they actually put one with me and we're chatting like we did. And I asked him what he did before and he was a bank manager. And he'd quit that to do a house up and renovate a house. So he actually didn't work for a whole year. And I said to him, wow, you, know, so you must have like, had a you know, big sum of money or whatever. And he, you know what he said? He said, it's actually amazing. When you don't have to go to work every day. He didn't plan to be off for a year. He said, but when you don't have to go to work every day, so you don't need to get your suit dry cleaned. You don't need to get five, five shirts a week dry cleaned or you know, from the dry cleans. You don't have to buy a lunch every day. You don't have to buy a coffee every day on the way into work. You don't have to commute and put all that wear and tear on your car or spend it on fuel or train fare or whatever. You don't have to get back at the end of the day. You don't have to, to go to the work stews, <laughs> you know, where you kind of meet up with everybody and it's a bit rude if you don't go for a drink on a Friday. You don't have to work and you'll spend 20, 30, 40 quid before you even know it, you know, and all that kind of stuff. And then you're too tired to cook, so you have a takeaway, don't you, and stuff like that some days because you've had a bad day at work and stuff. And he said, I was amazed at how cheaply you can actually live if you don't have to go to work. And you end up going to work to pay bills so you can go to work, to pay bills so you can go to work. <laughs> and if you can break out of that cycle. Um, yeah. So yeah, so thank top you. stuff, Les, thank you very much. Um, You're welcome, Paul, my pleasure. Uh, so again, I just want to say it again, because it's so good. You've got a guy there who's done it, who's willing to teach you, who does teach with the strategies and the tools that we can give you access to. 
and up to we're up to eight hours a day now live trading sessions uh, that we can help you do it so i don't think there's much better out there uh, and it's all zero high so click the button around here if there's a button because that should take you back to the person that sent you this video if not if somebody just shared with it or you're watching one of the groups get back to the person who referred you and you could get you could be on leslie's session tonight okay you honestly could be on Leslie's session tonight if you come in on the seven day Iron Academy trial. And uh, Bob Proctor, by the way, trains exclusively. He does some exclusive training, I should say. He does some exclusive training just for people in, uh, in Iron Academy as well, like you mentioned earlier. If you don't know Bob Proctor, pretty much the size you can go in the world of self development, one of the top guys there. Great guy as well. And he actually came to the live event, but he also teaches about once every two, three weeks as well for us now. So. Another big plus if you're into that side of things, come and get some great Bob Proctor training as well. So with that said, we're out of here. Thanks again, Les. Appreciate it. My pleasure. See you again. Cheers.